Cloud seeding enhances a cloud to drop more rain and snow by adding tiny ice nuclei to the cloud. Essentially, you either use a plane or you use ground-based cannon. You shoot the particles into the clouds or you fly above the clouds and you draw particles into the clouds. To learn more about what exactly cloud seeding is, we spoke with atmospheric science professor Zubin Zhang with the University of Arizona. He tells us the practice actually began back in the 1940s. Initially as a military uh, research. Professor Zhang says it can be useful to desert climate areas that need more rain, but not act as a solution. When it comes to cloud seeding, Professor Zhang says while it can add a little bit more rain to a rainfall, it shouldn't add enough to cause concern. Say we had a recent storm, for example, that dropped about an inch of rainfall. According to Professor Zhang, if it was cloud seeded, it would only add about an extra 10 to 15 percent more rainfall. And this is only if everything goes smoothly. Only under certain conditions. Most of the time, it is very difficult. Some companies in Arizona are currently researching the benefits cloud seeding can have in the state. And the Central Arizona Project says that they're working on studies and funding for cloud seeding in the upper Colorado River Basin, primarily in Wyoming and Utah. So some states like Utah offer funding for cloud seeding research. They directed $12 million last year to their program. But right now, Arizona does not have something similar. Hmm. So, all right, so cloud seeding in mm -hmm. my educational and <laughs> informational video. It's very interesting. It is. It is fascinating. So it can drop more rain. Are mm -hmm. there any other factors, any other perks that it has? Yeah, what's really cool is it can actually do the opposite. It can make a storm a little bit weaker. Back in 2008, if you remember the Beijing Olympics, mm -hmm. well, CNN reported that China actually used this sort of process to weaken storms so it wouldn't rain or hail during any of the games. Wow. So I wonder how that would play in hurricanes. So controlling Mother Nature, essentially. <laughs> <laughs> Is that possible? I never heard of this yeah. until now, Stephen. It's very thank interesting. Oh, yes. Fascinating. Thank you. Well, the Arizona.